Welcome back for another video. Today I'm gonna practice hole in one. Um, yeah, I played this one with the same state to practice for the computation. This game was published by Digitech in 1988. So as I said, this is not uh, for the competition. This is just for me to practice the game. Today I'm gonna practice and I show you how I played the classics all. Classic holes has got 18 holes. I think to, to do par you need 40 shots in total. So let's see how it went and uh, I'm gonna show you all the tricks to, to beat the game really. This is what I'm gonna show you. And remember I built this uh, in uh, using save states so that's why it looks unbelievably, unbelievably good but uh, probably this is just as a tutorial to show you how to beat the game. So let's start with uh, all one pick a pattern. This one is very easy to remember how to beat with one shot because uh, yeah, you just need to place the ball on the edge and just just put a little bit uh, like this on the right and it will go straight in. Let's go just a triangle, all two. Par here is two. Here, to beat the game, I think here with one shot is impossible, I, I couldn't figure it out, but let's see. Yeah, this was uh, the save, just play safe, don't try to mess it up, because uh, it's very easy to screw it, screw it up. So what you need to do, you just need to play safe and do it with uh, two shots, so at least it will be, be alright. Over and under, all three. This one. I could never figure it out how to beat it okay. with uh, mm -hmm. one shot, so play safe, just try to make the ball reach the, the hole with a very gentle shot, because if it's too, sh too strong, the ball will come back. Yeah, this is the way I did it, like this, very, very, very gentle, without any risk. Yeah, this is the way to beat it. The ball's hole! All four, part two. This one is very, very easy to beat with one shot. You just need to follow this guidance. So just watch attentively the video and just, yeah, do like this. Just try to memorize it. It will take some time, but you will learn it. I hope this video will help. Bridge with sun. This one. Paris 2. This one I never understood how to do it in one shot. I think it's impossible probably. At least for me, the, the safest way is to do like a very strong shot so that it goes out of the sand like that. And then play safe like that. If it's in the green, even if it's far, you can still do it with one shot. Gently. Yeah. Like that. Easy, easy, does it? All six. This is really easy. I would say yes, it, 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 it's very easy. It's very easy to figure it out, how to beat it with one shot. You just need to be careful not to hit that edge, but uh, it's very easy to figure it out. Just watch the video two, three times and uh, it will help you. Around the world, all seven. This is very tough. Because par is two, and is probably the number of shots that you can do. I don't think you can do it with one, but maybe if I was shooting stronger, maybe I could have done it with one, but uh, I, I think I was playing safe. If the shot is too strong, sometimes the ball uh, just starts jumping around, so I prefer to do this way, which uh, helped me actually to do well. Remember, I did this uh, everything with save state, so I tried five, six times, and I just cut the part that went wrong. So geometry, geometry zero one. This part three, this is really, really, really difficult. This one, to figure it out, I had to try ten times, maybe? This is the, the one that succeeded. You need to shoot diagonally and hoping that it goes there. Don't tell me how, but it looks like diagonally to avoid that slope. The first slope. And the second slope as well, by hitting the red thing. Oh, 
round we go all nine par three this is really tricky because you can easily mess it up so you need to shoot very very gently you can measure the shot using this circle so you can put the ball this way and shoot this uh, very very gently like that it should work if you are, if you memorize the video watch it attentively it should help you the second shot is very easy because you just face the hole so you just need to shoot very gently but straight inside this uh, tunnel really yeah yay yeah then I should see this oh, the first one I did very well 15 shots minus 5 so I did 15 instead of 20, which is really, really good. The second part is more difficult. This is not easy at all. Easy is not easy at all. Here, you can mess it up and lose many shots. But here, I, I went for the safest uh, possible way, which is this. I did a lot of adjustment. This looks like the perfect way to shoot because the ball will stop exactly near the beginning of the next see the next uh, part which is this so yeah that was amazing I was lucky but good try to see try to shoot the way I did and let me know in the comment below if it worked for you touch of magic all 11 this one is using tele teletransporter so you need to shoot the ball in the teletransporter in a very strong way that he will reach the last teletransporter which is on the left. So the way I did, I measure it this way, which is, uh, let's see, uh, I think it's easy to memorize because I was using the graphics, that uh, vertical line which is, uh, you can see, above the green teleporter. See here, the ball, if it stops like this, you can do it with two, shot i don't think it is possible to do it with one shot so yeah this is very tough to do pipe stream all 12 part 3 this one i never understood it because sometimes the ball goes out in the water maybe to beat it you need to just eat straight where the arrow is like that if you do like this it worked for me so let me know if it works for you. I oh, think at the end of the day, if it works, so you do it with two shots instead of three. So it's minus mm -hmm. one, which is really good. Maybe this one uh, you can learn it. Next one, under and over, all 13, part two. This one is tricky because if you shoot too strongly, the ball will come back. So you need to shoot in a way that the ball will stay on the other side and it doesn't stay under. So let's see how it went. Yeah, like this. I was a little bit lucky because the ball, the ball was just stopped on the edge, but this is probably the way. Maybe my shot was a little bit too strong. Maybe next time I should shoot a little bit less than that. Okay, water locked. All 14, part 2. This one is a little bit... Um, I don't say easy, but it's, uh, it's a little bit uh, awkward because uh, what you need to do here, I just, how can you, it cannot really beat with one shot, but uh, you don't need to shoot very strongly, otherwise the ball will come back when you hit that triangle. So I did a very gentle shot and the ball stopped near the hole. Let's see, play safe maybe here, you don't need to try with one. Snack time, all 15, part 2. This one is also, I would say, play safe here because this one is very difficult to beat with one shot. So play safe. I didn't do any discovery here. I just played very cleverly by hitting the, the this red, uh, um, yeah, the red part here and again of the table. The just ball stays in near, uh, just land near the hole, and then you play safe with a very gentle shot. That's it. No, really. Posted. All 16. This is very, very difficult. This one I tried many times. I think the, the safest is just to play straight into the hole. The problem, you cannot play straight because there is a post. So you just need to try this way and hope that the ball will stay up. See, if it goes down, I was lucky that hit the post, but... Uh, you need to hope in a little bit of luck here because there is no other way to do it probably, I'm not sure. But I did it in two shots. 
Lazy T, hole 17, part 2. Here, and this is very easy with two shots, so to be, yeah, part 2, it's, it's feasible. So to do it, you just need to hit the triangle at the very probably edge. The edge of the triangle, but straight, with a straight shot. If the, the ball doesn't go straight, then it spins, it doesn't uh, throw the ball horizontally left. So be careful, shoot exactly how I did it. Okay? Then, yeah, here, do very gentle, don't risk because otherwise go down. The windmill is the last one. This one is a little bit like a mystery because uh, I never understood uh, how you can beat it with one shot. To be honest, yeah, it's tough with one shot because uh, yeah, the ball you don't you cannot control the way the ball goes in and goes out. So I'm happy to do it with two shots. Per uh, with part two is fine. Uh, yeah, this is the way I did it. And this is the last hole. I hope that this video tutorial for beating the game uh, helps you. I'm gonna watch this video myself, to be honest. I, I did this video for myself because uh, I want to try to beat the game. With, uh, in order to, to beat the game, uh, I'm participating to the Lemon Amiga competition. And uh, yeah, to get the competition star, you need uh, for, to beat this uh, with par. So basically 33 I did here, 7 under, probably I want to beat this uh, classic with 40 shots. But uh, please watch the video and let me know if it's helpful for you. And uh, yeah, thank you so much. If you have uh, any comment, please add your comment below. Let me know if you find this video useful. And uh, yeah, I will see you on the next video. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.